Welcome everybody, my name is Nicola Betsy and this is my group. We are working on a project, its name is Virus Scanner. This project gives us the possibility to learn about some viruses. The virus that we choose is measles. This is the product that we made. We made a website full of information about it. Let's check them. I will present you the five W's of measles. Measles, called even rubella, red measles and English measles, is one of the most contagious vaccine-preventable virus known. So, the most people in the world are vaccinated. The five W's about measles. When? Measles began to appear around the 60th century. What? The virus is called measles, but even rubella, red measles and English measles. How? You can become ill with measles due to an airborne infection. So, if two kids are near to each other and one of them has measles, probably the other can get infected. Who? Measles is a very contagious disease that often affects children between 1 and 3 years old, so it's called infantile. That means that most people in the world that has measles are kids, where measles can be contracted worldwide. So, measles is not in a precise place, it's in all the world. So next we have Leonardo De Rossi that is gonna explain us about the virus. Measles is a highly contagious viral disease. It remains an important case of death among young children globally, despite the viability of safe and effective vaccines. Measles is transmitted via droplets from the nose, mouth and throat on infected persons. Initial symptoms, which usually appear after 12 days after infections, include high fever, a runny nose, bloodshot eyes, and a tiny white spot on the inside of the mouth. Several days later, a rash develops, starting on the face and the upper neck and gradually spreading downwards. Several measles are more likely among poorly nosed young children, especially those with insufficient vitamin A or whose immune systems has been weakened by HIV or IEDS or other disease. The most serious complications include blindness, severe diarrhea and rated day returns, and severe respiration infections such as pneumonia. Routine measles vaccination for children, combined with mass immunization campaigns in countries with low routine coverage, are the key public health strategies to reduce the global measles death. Now we have Davide Baroni with the start of measles. In the 9th century, a Persian doctor published one of the first written accounts of measles disease. Francis Ohm demonstrated that measles is caused by an infection agent in the blood of patients. Now we have Gerardo explain us about measles. Hi, I'm Gerardo, and now I speak to you something about the measles. The most affected targets are children under age of five. Its vaccine is available from 2018. It was one of the most important vaccines for the Earth. Before it was there, 140,000 deaths globally. This vaccine prevented about 32 million deaths. For this reason, it's considered one of the most important, important vaccines. Practically, the death rate of measles has decreased by 73%. Still, this vaccine is given to a total percentage of children of 86%. Unfortunately, in 2017, 110,000 people died from this disease. From this information, it can be understood that the measles affairs good or bad passed. 
I pass the word to my companions. Now we have Viviana that will talk about measles evolution. I'm Viviana and I speak about measles evolution from the transmission to the possible complications. The most contagious virus is spread by aerosol and this is the case of measles. After 10 days of incubation the first symptoms appear. They are similar to the flu symptoms. High fever, coughing and sneezing, runny blocked the nose but also symptoms more characteristic like sore eyes, loss of appetite, tightness and spots in the mouth. After a few days the rash breaks out. It's made up of small red brown, flat or slightly raised spot. For s some people it's itchy. For some people it's itchy. The people that are most at risk are children with weakened immune system and the adults. In short, the possible complications are air infection, eye infection and airways infection that can be more or less dangerous.